I'm Jamie from Polyjohn, and I'm here to talk about some new spring changes that we have coming up. Uh, we have a redesigned spring and a new high strength nylon plastic clip that we are using and replacing this steel clip. Uh, this is retrofitable to any PJ, Fleet, Comfort XL units that we've had in the past. The, uh, if you order a PC 100 800C, it would come with the, this is a barrel end spring assembly, and it would come with the plastic clip, the high strength nylon plastic clip. The reason we made this change was to make the assembly process a little bit better. The current process was to put the spring assembly in the door and you would take a vice grips and you would clamp onto the cable to uh, stretch out the cable and then insert the ball end of the cable into a steel clip. With the new method, we are able to bypass using a vice grips. The vice grips, when it clamps down onto the cable, it could cause premature failure after a while, uh, breaks the coating on the cable, so it's not desirable. Again, here is the old spring assembly package with the steel clip and the ball end uh, cable. Now, it's important to know that this ball end cable cannot be used in the plastic clip. It could only be used in the steel clip. And here we have the new and improved barrel end uh, cable with the plastic clip. The barrel end can be used with the steel clip or the plastic clip. So whenever replacing the spring assembly, it's important to uh, use the barrel end spring assembly. And ideally you would use the plastic clip because it works so much better in keeping that cable from breaking. So this uh, assembly process would be similar to how you were currently using it. This part anyway, you insert your spring assembly into the PJN3 door, the front assembly. And I just use the clip here, put it in the barrel, and then pull this into the final resting position. Then you take the clip, insert it onto the cable like so. Now in the past, you've received your front assemblies with the steel clip already installed on the front assembly. Uh, with this new plastic clip, we are shipping this in the small parts bag. So you will have to assemble it, but it keeps this cable from being frayed for, during installation. Now the way, the ideal way to do this is to do this at this point where you have the front assembly attached to the base without everything, anything else being attached. However, this, and that would require just a one person operation. However, it can be done when you have all your walls attached to your unit, or if you're replacing your spring assembly in the, in the field, uh, it would require two people to replace that plastic clip. One person from the outside uh, putting the rivets in, and the other person on the inside putting the clip on. But it can be done. I'm gonna show you the one person method right now. So I got uh, an awl. You can use uh, anything like that, small, sharp, whatever, help you guide it into the hole. And I'm going to pull that into position and then using a rivet gun with a PC000109 rivet I'm going to insert this from the outside into the bottom hole take my backup washer and using another 109 rivet with backup complete installation. Now for the fleet assembly, the process is a little bit easier. Uh, you see we don't have a cabana on the unit right now, however this installation process would have to be done after the cabana is on because these rivets that you attach the clip with go through the side panel. So the side panel has to be in the in the jam. We're just showing it for so you can see this process. So the, you would install your spring assembly into your door as you normally would and then take your clip, plastic clip, put it on the barrel end of the cable like so. And I'm going to use the normal PC000104 rivet. And I'm going to use the rivet to pull the cable, the spring cable into place. Go like that. Put that into place. 
Do the same thing with the bottom rivet. Push this down to get the holes aligned. And rivet in place. So that completes the process of assembling the PJN3 and the fleet unit. Uh, the process for doing the Comfort XL and the ADA unit are very similar. So if you have any questions about this product or any other products that we carry here at Polyjohn, please give us a call or contact us on our website at www.polyjohn.com. Thank you and have a great day.